Hey, so guys, it's me, Stan Lee, and welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to be talking about the evolution of Morgs and his YouTube channel. We will be talking about how he went from a small creator to a large creator to an even larger creator and then to a somewhat smaller but still large creator. We will also be going over the important people to his YouTube channel, like his mom, his dad, and etc. Presumably, Morg started his YouTube journey on the 15th of June in 2014 with a Minecraft video named Minecraft Faction Based Speed Build Plus Tour. After uploading a mere six videos, he had a thousand subscribers. I'm jealous. Hey guys, Morgan here, and today we have a Q&A because we just hit 1k subs. And today we have my 3k subs Q&A. should start talking about Morgs because he is the main focus of the channel. The best place to start off is where he started off in the public eye. And it wasn't when he was a smaller creator, it was when he was a large creator. This was also the height of his cringe. And the best way to talk about this topic is with Morgs himself. Now, I'm not talking to Morgs, I'm just going to play one of his videos because he explains it very well in the video explaining why he's leaving YouTube for just a little bit. The majority of you guys probably watching this know me as the crazy guy who's always screaming, who's clickbaiting, who's uh, making these weird challenge videos with with their parents and it's true guys that that's the videos I've been making and that's how I've been I guess portraying myself online to the camera but the truth is guys that isn't me that's an exaggerated version of me very exaggerated version of me I should say after this video Morris went on to make another video a couple months after talking about his experience and what he went through he released a documentary named the real Morg, explaining in more detail what happened so yeah, one year after taking the biggest risk of my life, leaving school, the proudest moment of my life happened. I bought my very own house, aged 16. And then after I moved into the house, all hell broke loose. <laughs> just getting louder and louder and louder in my videos. People were kind of interested by it. I don't know if everybody liked it, but you know, when I first started, man, people were interested by it. There was a lot of hype. I think half the people were like, we want the old morgues back, but the other half were just so blown away by this absolute like nutcase running around his house, smashing the lot up. I kind of, I guess I, I enjoyed it when it started. I enjoyed it, man. I enjoyed being more, you know, hyper on camera, and I enjoyed seeing the reaction to it because uh, it was just so different. And um, yeah, it was. It, it certainly like created a storm. You can say that. Do you feel like you were a nuisance to uh, Chilla Martin with all the chaos you caused? Yes, <laughs> absolutely. <laughs> well, we'll get back to Morgs later and talk about his early days in YouTube and his now days in YouTube. But first, on topic, I'll be talking about Morgz's mom and Morgz's dad. Well, no, not dad, but stepdad, Bald Martin. Bald Martin is the most chaotic and even my most favorite person on the Morgz channel. If you want to put it into simple terms, he's a character just like Patrick. It's kind of dumb and makes fun of it, but he's self-aware at that point, even playing it out for content. He likes beans. of the Morgs channel, at least in my opinion. <laughs> he also has his own YouTube channel, but hasn't posted on it in literally a year. 
please Martin, upload more videos, we need more content. Now that we talked about Morris' stepdad, let's talk about Morris' dad a little bit. He's only been in a very few amount of videos, he's not often featured, but sometimes he is. As a result of him not being on there so much, we can't really tell what his ideas are and what his character is really supposed to be. All we know is that he doesn't live in the Morg's house. Okay, this is a question to you. If this video right here yep. gets 40,000 likes, will you let me temporarily, okay, temporarily dye your hair? I can't, can I? How can I? On the weekend, so it doesn't go through to work. <laughs> Come on! Not for 40,000 likes, no way. What More for then? That. What for then? 100,000 likes. Oh, sorry. Oh my goodness. 100. What? 100,000 <laughs> likes for me? Wait, wait, wait. Dye wait, my wait, hair. Wait, wait, wait. Oh. Look. Oh my goodness, they only need like less than 500 likes. Guys. Please like this video. I know it's really old, but that would be funny if you actually did it. So, go like this video as well as like my video right now. Do that right now. And then come back, please. Next off, we have Morg's mom. She's in quite a lot of videos and uh, has her own channel that is more prominent than Bald Martin's channel. One of the things that really amazes me, though, is how much Morgs likes his mom. I mean, Morgs is literally inviting her to live with him. It, like, it's crazy. For everybody that had doubted the decision to take Morgan out of school, to then be moving into a house that Morgan had bought for me to live in with him, was absolutely unbelievable. I've worked all my life since I was like 15, and I couldn't never have dreamt of having a house that was worth that much money and that's what youtube and the passion um you know gave him gave me but i guess it's also a business deal because they do work together on videos and stuff also if we're gonna talk about morris mom we're gonna also have to talk about willany but we will get to reaction channels later so last off we're gonna talk about mini morgs now mini morgs uh, no one really knows who he is but he is rumored to be morgs's cousin uh, we don't really know if that's the truth or if he's like a half cousin or something, but most people tend to assume that he's Morgs' half cousin. Mini Morgs and Martin are my two favorite characters, Morgs, and I think that'll stay that way. So this video is basically over, and in part two of this documentary, we're going to be going over Morgz's content and Morgz himself, and seeing how his channel developed over time and how he changed. Well, you guys liked my video enough to stay till the end, so I'm guessing that you'll want to hit the subscribe button and like, especially if you want to see the part two to this video, and thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.